Imagine waking up to the news that an asteroid is going to hit the Earth, not in some distant sci-fi future or novel, but in real life, and in less than a decade. While that might sound like the plot of a disaster movie, it's actually not, because we have recently discovered a new asteroid that has a decent chance at hitting the Earth. But the big question here is, should we be panicking, or is this just another doomsday hoax that is going to blow over? Well, let's break it down. For starters, let's talk about what we're actually dealing with here. Asteroids are basically space rocks left over from the birth of the solar system 4.6 billion years ago. They are ancient relics drifting through space like cosmic time capsules. Asteroids are typically rocky or metallic, and most of them hang out in the asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter, minding their own business. But sometimes, one decides to take a little detour towards us. Now, asteroids that come hurtling towards the Earth don't always come from the asteroid belt. They can come from other places further out in space, but usually they do come from the belt. So now let's talk about our special asteroid. This new asteroid, named 2024 YR4, is what's called a near-Earth object. And near Earth means exactly what you think it would. It's an object that's coming close to the Earth. It was first spotted in December 2024, and scientists immediately noted something spicy about its trajectory. It's coming pretty close to our planet, close enough that they started running the numbers. And guess what? Turns out there's a decent chance it could impact the Earth in the year 2032. The asteroid is estimated to be 130 to 300 feet in length and its impact could have pretty big consequences. So let's say, purely hypothetically, it does hit us. What's going to happen? Well, the good news is it's not gonna be the dinosaur level extinction that we might think of when we think of an asteroid, so that's good. This asteroid is being called a city killer rather than a planet destroyer, which planet destroyer is a low bar, but it's still better than that, I guess. If the asteroid collided with our Earth or exploded in the atmosphere, it could create a blast big enough to level a major metropolitan area. So perhaps the big question now is, should we be worried? Well, yes and also no. Let me explain. Here's the deal. Asteroid impact predictions are tricky. Right now, the odds of this thing hitting us are about 2%, which means there is a 98% chance it won't and that's a bet most of us would probably take. But this could change, and right now there is enough of a possibility that scientists are keeping a close eye on it. We, as the human race, have a pretty low threshold for what catches our attention in space. If there is as little as a 1% impact probability, the big names in planetary defense begin keeping a close eye on it. That might sound like overkill, but when you think about it, we are dealing with the fate of the planet, so you don't really want to mess around. As far as our asteroid, we will continue to monitor it as it hurtles through space, and it's possible the impact probability could change. It could rise or go down in the coming months and years. We'll have to see. So over the next few months, telescopes, most notably including the James Webb Space Telescope, are going to get a better look. More data means better calculations, which could confirm it'll miss us entirely or give us a clearer idea of what we need to do next. But let's just say for the sake of hypothetical fun, the asteroid is on a collision course with Earth and it's going to hit us. Could we stop it? Well, turns out, yeah, we probably could, which is sick. In 2022, NASA's DART mission, the Double Asteroid Redirection Test, successfully slammed a spacecraft into an asteroid called Dimorphos, and it changed its orbit. Which means basically we played cosmic billiards and we won. The test proved that with enough time, we could theoretically nudge an asteroid off course before it reaches Earth. Scientists have a few other tricks up their sleeves too, like using the gravity of a spacecraft to slowly pull an asteroid off its path, or even using solar-powered lasers to heat up and push an asteroid away. So is this asteroid going to destroy us all? Probably not, which is good. But it is a reminder that our universe is vast and full of surprises and discoveries. 
Space is a wild place, and the Earth has been hit before and most likely will be hit again. But thanks to modern science, we are not just sitting ducks. And if nothing else, it is a great excuse to look up at the night sky and appreciate the fact that we live in a fascinating, complex world that never ceases to catch our attention and amaze us. If you like this video, please go ahead and leave a like down below and be sure to hit that subscribe button to keep learning about nature and science. If you want to learn more about space, specifically the total solar eclipse that happened not too long ago, check out the playlist I did on it right here. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.